Hi, Sasha. Thank you for taking a few minutes to talk to us today. At Nokia, we talk about how important it is for our customers to automate their network operations. Do you think they're ready for it? Well, it's an interesting question because I think we are finding ourselves in this uh, situation where from a technology perspective, we are ready as an industry and our customers are ready to automate a lot of things. But the challenges that we are facing now are more of a human nature. The organizational challenges, the challenges facing the kind of uh, trust. Uh, do we trust automation? Do we trust uh, our ability to automate and really relinquish the control, et cetera, et cetera. So those are the kinds of things that we are, we are facing. And there's a lot of work we are doing in the products to help our customers overcome those challenges and those fears. Automation is a broad topic and every customer has their own specific requirements. In your interactions with our customers, what are the different types of needs that come up? But as you know, we have a large number of cu customers and ranging from very large tier one service providers to very small uh, operators or verticals uh, such as transportation companies, utility companies, and their needs uh, vary. Uh, some of them uh, uh, have a need for very open and programmable platforms so that they can engage their network engineering teams and their op uh, operations teams in building their own products and integrating it on the networks. Well, some others have a need for pre-integrated, off-the-shelf solutions, set of applications that help them solve their problems without them having to do much. And then there's also, also need, increased need for better management of traffic in a network, better control of traffic in a network through a centralized controller. So we see a variety of needs. And how does the Nokia Network Services platform address those needs? Well, by looking at each of those uh, specific needs, looking at the requirements and the needs of the customers who fit in that category, and building, building the applications to suit the, 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 those needs. For example, in the area of programmability, we've been investing tremendously in open interfaces, in workflow uh, engines, in templating, in intent-based networking, in model-driven mediation in, the, in a multi vendor environments. While in a, say, traffic engineering and traffic control case, there's a whole set of SDN applications that uh, take care of a traffic optimization, resource optimization in IP, IP and optical networking, in P express peering on the edge, and 5G slicing f uh, with NFIX. So a variety of different needs with, uh, matched with a variety of different applications within an SP platform to, to meet those needs. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you for having me. Thank you.